I'm going to analyze question one of previous year, three previous years, uh, 2018, 2020, and 2021 question paper, the practical one. Okay, let's start off with 2018. Okay, all these question papers are year-end question papers. So it's the final examinations. Um, the reason I'm using these is because I feel that they are basically set up by the same people so we can get a better idea and a pattern of what to expect in your exam. Okay, so if I look at the first one, let's open the memo. Come on. first come check the memo. Okay, so the first question was you need to change the the color of the panel, the color of the font, the size of the font, and the caption of the panel. So these two were constants. Uh, font size was integer property. This was a string property. So that's basically straightforward. Um, remember question one, the general programming is usually the easiest question of the four. So most of the learners should be able to do question one. <coughs> okay, if you look at 1.2, uh, we had some mathematical calculations like pi, we needed to display something, a float value, as one decimal over here. If I remember correctly, the question asked us to calculate the volume. Okay, so it's some mathematical calculations in question one. Let's go down a little bit more. Okay, random was here. You needed you needed to pick a random number. We needed to use a for statement, uh, if statement, if statement, if statement with a mod. Okay, I tend to see mod quite a lot in question one in the final exams. So mod is important here. There's an uppercase. Okay, so you should you were supposed to take a whole string and make it uppercase over here we have a while statement so it's another loop and a case statement and another if statement uh, we have a break in here so the break will break out of the current while statement so all of this is basically grade 10 coding okay so started off very easy with some constants that you needed to set some properties that you need to set remember the properties you must set it uh, in the coding you can't just change it in the object inspector okay and then there were mathematical calculations if you need to use those mathematical calculations some of these math functions and procedures you need to add math in the users on top okay so you need to use the math I'm going to jump to the next one. 2020 question paper, the memo. To see if I can see any similarities there. Okay, again, it starts off with changing some properties like this font size of a combo box uh, you needed to add something into that combo box you needed to set the item index to zero okay, so that's quite similar to what the 2018 one started off then next one we use the input box was again some calculations that you need to do here if statement if the one is bigger than the other one some smaller mathematical calculations 
we needed to display something some float again in a string so float to string f is important for question one definitely okay again we have a mod so 2018 and 2020 you needed to know the mod function okay the mod uh, we have a while statement again so it's the same as 2018 okay you need the diff divide okay again the uppercase so uppercase is in, is in both 2018 and 2020 um, in this one we have some string handling functions and procedures like length I did not see any string handling in 2018 question paper so in 2020 there was some string handling length you needed to use the if in okay the in with the if statement for multiple options okay so there's only one while statement oh here's the for statement as well so there's a while statement and a for statement there were uppercase mod were in both okay, so this one i have in the if statement that 2018 did not have okay let's open up another one the last one 2021 Okay, 2021. This time it was a label they used. So the caption must be changed. The color, so again, it's a constant that you need to change. So it's very similar to the 2018 one. This time it was a panel. In 2021, it was a label. So it's the caption, the color, the size, and font name. Okay, this was font size. 2020 it was just the size not the name okay so size is in all three question papers okay, if you continue they use the constant over here again small calculations multiplication division here's another mathematical function seal so you needed to add the math unit on top that coding is not here at the moment but yeah you needed to use you needed to add the math on top okay so there were some yes here here's some more pi power so the mathematical functions is important for question one definitely should expect a four. There's our four statement. There's another four statement. We go on. Here's a char function. Okay, a char function. And there's a repeat statement. Okay, so in 2018, there were a while statement. 2020. There were while statement, but no repeat statements. In 2021, there's a repeat statement, but I don't see a while statement. So what that's telling me is that you will definitely expect to get a for statement, and then either a repeat or a while statement. So you will need to know both of them. And then they use mathematical calculations in all three question papers. Question. The first part of the question is quite easy just to set those properties. Um, you need to know your mod and your diff because I see that is used quite a lot. I don't see the mod in question three though. Oh, the question paper three is by. No, there's no mod in this one. But the chances of you getting the mod function is quite high. This one actually uses one that we don't use that often. It's like a char and a repeat until. Okay, 
So you can't only know the four in a while, you need to know the repeat statement as well. And then the seal mathematical function. Okay, so that's a summary for question one.